शुक्ला ब्रह्म विचार सार परमाध्याम जगत व्यापिनी वीणा पुस्तक धारिणी मभेदा झाड्या अंधकारापहा हस्ते स्फाटिक मलिका विदती पद्मासने संस्थिता वंदेता परमेश्वरी भगवती बुद्धि प्रदा शारदा दत्वा सरस्वती देवी शुद्धा गुण्या कौम्यहम पाणिनीय प्रवेशाय लघु सिद्धांत कौमुदी So we were looking at Visarga Sandhi. We saw the sutras, Visarjaniya Sisaha, Khari Pare and Vajari. Optionally, Visarga or Sakara Adesha when a Shar letter follows. This is for Ru. Ru ho Visarga or Visarga Se Visarga. Here in Vajari, Visarga Se Visarga earlier Ru ho. And we saw the Rukto Prakaranam uh, from 8.2.1 to 8.2.12. Now, there is another Rukto Prakaranam. So, Rukto is ordained in two places. If you look at the Ashtadhyayi, see the eight, second Pada of the 8th chapter, uh, not the second Pada, I am sorry, first Pada, first Pada of the 8th chapter, uh, eight, third Pada, I am sorry, Thoroughly confused with this uh, online copy. So, uh, when uh, Tripadi starts from 8 to 1, in 8 3 1, the third uh, pada of the 8th chapter, here Ru Prakarnam starts. And Ru Prakarnam is what? Uh, from 8 3 1 to 8 3 12. There is another Ru Prakarnam here, as Ru Prakarnam and the, as in the sense where Ru is ordained. Here, in the first Ru Prakarana, which we saw, 8.3.1 to 8.3.12, whenever Ru is ordained, Atra Anunasika Purvasyatuva or Anunasikat Paronuswara. In, only in this Ru Prakarana. So, this Atra is related to this Ru Prakarana from 8.3.1 to 8.3.12. Whenever Ru is ordained, is prescribed, then as soon as that Ru Vidhi is applied, then either you have to make the earlier Anunasika or you have to add an uh, anu, anuswara. So Anunasika or uh, sorry, uh, Anunasika or Anuswara should be added only in this Ruvidi. Now the next sutra which is coming up, which is uh, which is the 8 to 66. So in 8 to 66, which is earlier, earlier to this, there is another Ru here, 8 to 66. So there is Sasajusho Ru. We have seen this. Goes till 71. So this Ru Prakarana also, you see Ru here. It goes till 7, 71. So there is a Ru ordained here as well. But here, when Ru is ordained, you should not make Anunasika or Anuswara for the earlier letter. letter. You should not do that. This is just Ru with no additional Adeshas preceding whether Anunasika or Anuswara like the earlier Ru. So Sasa, Sasa Jusho Ru. This is the Sutra. Next Sutra is Sasa Jusho Ru. What is the Sutra? Sa and Sajushasha. So Sa and Sajush. Sasa Jusha. Sajush is one word. So Sa dash se sakarasya sajushah sajush is a, a pratipadika uh, which means saha jushate iti sajush so those who dwell together rather uh, one who dwells together one who dwells together is what a friend so mitra mityartha sajush means mitram but not the meaning mitram not any word only when it is sajush when Sajush is there, that Shakara, Tasya Ru Bhavati. The Shakara takes Ru Adesha or any Sakara, any Padanta Sakara takes uh, Ru Adesha. This we have seen many times. Sakara we have seen. So this is the Sutra which makes uh, the Refa Adesha. Ru, uh, the difference between Refa and Ru we will see in some Sutras where Refa will take some Adesha. Refa, uh, just a Refa and Refa from a Ru they are treated differently based on the sutra. Otherwise, in some sutras, refa, whether from ru or from just a refa, 
both are treated together. Therefore, there is a technical difference between Rafa, uh, Rafa, the plain Rafa, and a Rafa from Ru. This we have to remember. So, Sasajushaha Ru. What is the case here? Sasajushaha. Sasajushaha is um, actually the samasa has to be seen here. What is the samasa? Here, samasa is um, Sascha Sajuscha. Uh, Sasa Jushau, it should be Sasa Jushau and Sakarad Akara Ucharan Artha Tayo Tayo Ho Saso Jusho Ho. Now see, uh, actually I said Sasa Jushaha. This would be singular. Actually, this is wrong. It should be Sasa Jusho Ho. Now, what happened to this uh, Visarga here? This will see in the uh, next sutra, uh, not in the next immediate next sutra. Some sutras later we will see Rori. I mentioned this earlier also Rori. So when Repha is followed by another Repha, that uh, Repha, uh, Rori, uh, there is a Lopa. There is a Lopa of the Repha. Which Repha? This Repha. So in this Sutra itself, it is actually Sasa Jushoho, which is actually Sasa Jusho means it is a Repha actually. There, there is a Repha there. It has never become a Visarga. See, although it is Visarga Prakarana, Visarga Adesha has to happen for Visarga to be read, although we will say this is Saso Jushoho when, when we take an Avasana. When there is an Avasana, this Repha is no longer there. This Ru is no longer there. How, how, why is it no longer there? Because I am not doing a Sandhi. I am saying Saso Jushoho. Then I say Ru. That time Visarga Adesha will come by the uh, set of Sutras. However, here in the Sutra itself, in the Sutra, Sutra you cannot take a pause. It is Saso Jusho Ruhu. So, Saso Jusho Ru you will read together. So, that time Sandhi is mandatory. And when it is mandatory, then it will never become a Visarga. What is it? Actually, it is uh, Sakara, which becomes Repha. So, this is O Sakara. Which O Sakara? Shashti Dvivachana. So, this is actually Shashti Dvivachana. And what happens to Shashti? And this is Adesha. Ru is Prathama Ekvachana. So, what happens to this uh, Sasti Os Pratya, Os Pratya Sakara will take Ru Adesha. By the same sutra, Saso Jusho Ru itself will uh, apply to the sutra and it will make Sakara as Repha. Once it becomes Repha, then since it is followed by another Repha here, then Rori Sutra, uh, which we will see a little later, Rori says what Raha Ri Pare Lopaha Bhavati. So, there is a Lopa there and when there is a Lopa of this Repa, this Repa here, which is actually Saso Jushor, so I am writing there itself, this Repa undergoes a Lopa, Rori by Rori. Once it undergoes a Lopa, then Dhalope Purvasya Dirgona, which we will see again, we'll, uh, after a while we will see, I am just explaining this Sutra, why it is Shashti Dvivachana. Then Rori, after Rori applies, Dhalope Purvasya Dirgona. Anaha by that sutta, Dirgonaha, Dirgonaha, Dirgaha, Anaha, Anaha of the un, this Okara is an un, un, un letter whenever there is a Dhakara Lopa or a Repha Lopa, here there is Repha Lopa, whenever there is a Repha Lopa, then its preceding un will take Dirgha Adesha, now the Okara is already Dirgha, so, uh, Parjanyavat, Parjanyavat meaning uh, it rains wherever it has rained, it still rains, just because the ground is wet, the rain does not stop falling there. So, Parjanyavat means the Sutra will apply although it does not have any effect. Okara will take Dirgha Adesha. Okara is already Dirgha. Therefore, Repha has undergone Lopa and Okara has become Okara. Okay. So, uh, do you have uh, Anuna, uh, what is this Ananunasika? I am not sure what you are saying Kalyanji. Anunasika. Do you have Anunasika elsewhere? Everywhere do you have Anunasika? For Ru, right? You are saying for Ru. Yeah, so do you have uh, uh, Anunasika elsewhere, wherever uh, it is there? 
I think uh, books do not print those. I am saying it is Rue. See, if it is not Rue, what will happen? Ukara will not go. If Ukara does not go, what, what is the Adesha? Rue. So, uh, you will get Rama Rue. It is not Rama Rue. It is Rama. Then it will become Ramaha. Otherwise, uh, how will you make Adesha? So, this has to be understood. Rue. Ukara the, has to be Anunasika. Otherwise, Upadesha is Anunasika. It will not apply. And you will be stuck with what when you are deriving, say, Ramaha. Rama plus Su you would make. This Su you have. Then you will, instead of this, you will get Rama Ru. Ramas and then Ramas will become Rama Ru. Not Rama Ru. Then how will you take away this Ukara? You can't. Then what will happen? It will remain Rama Ru. It has to become Rama. That will happen only when there it is, uh, it is Anunasika. Look at, in, look at Gita Press. Gita Press does not have Anunasika anywhere. As far as I know. You will find in very uh, few books you will find it because Swara itself is gone in uh, Patha. It is not there in uh, Patha itself. Okay. So anyway, coming back to what is the... Uh, so Ramaru, that example would have also worked. But here you see Sasajushoru Sakarasya Sajusa. So what is the Samasa here? Sakaraha Sascha. So Sascha. Sascha or actually... Um, uh, it will be Sakara. You can't decline. Akara will be Ucharan Artha. And then uh, Sascha. Sorry. Sascha. Sascha. Saju Sascha. Saju Shoho. Sasa Jushoho. Sasa Jushoho. Sasa Jushou, sorry, not Jushou, Sasa Jushou. Actually, uh, keeping the book and typing is a little difficult. So, Sasa Jushou, Itare Tara Dwandwa, Itare Tara Dwandwa, and Tayoho, Tayoho Shashti Dhyuvachana. So, the Sani, the Sakara and Sajush, Sajush are Sani. And when Sajush is the Pratipadika, that time Shakara uh, by Alontya, uh, uh, see uh, Alontya, Alo Antya only, Antya will take the Adesha, Alontyasya, Alontyasya uh, Sthane He Adesha Bhavati, not for the entire world. So which we have seen many times. Now, uh, Ruhu, Ruhu Adesha Bhavati and what is the Anuvritti? So 8266, if you go to 8266, Okay, 8 to 66. What is the Anurati here? 63. Nothing is there. Nothing is there. That's why it's a plain. Of course, there is Anurati of the Adhikara, Purvatra, Siddham, all that is there. Padasya. So, Padasya will be there. Now, so Padas, Padantasya. So, Padasya, there will be Anurati of Padasya. And we will say uh, Padantasya Sakarasya. Padantasya Sakarasya. So, this here we will mention it. Since we have not seen this for a long time, Shashti Ekvachana. Thereby, Sakara, which, which Sakara? Padanta Sakara, not any Sakara. Padanta Sakara and Padantasya Sajushaha Ruhu Adesha Bhavati. So, what does he say? Padantasya. You got the Tadanta Vidhi. Padantasya Sasya, Sasya Sakarasya, Akara Ucharanarthe, Sajushascha, Sajushascha Ruhu Syat. Now, what will happen? He is, he is not taking an example. We'll look at the example. We'll look at Sajush itself. So that we don't have to come back. We'll see Sajush itself in the beginning. Sajush. So Sajush plus Su. When you add Sajush plus Su, what will happen? Halniyabhyo uh, Sutesi Apruktam Look the Pratya. The Aprukta Pratya. Aprukta is a Pratya. Ekal Pratya. This Sakara, Sajush plus Sakara. Sakara is what? This Shakara is Hal. So Halantapada. Halni Abhyu. Uh, just like Marut. Marut Sakara, what happens to Su? Sup, Supluk happens. Here also there will be Supluk and you will be left with Sajush. Now when? So Halni Abhyu. Halni Abhyu. 
So Sakara is gone. Now Sajush. What will happen to this? It will take Ruadesha. It will become Repa. Saj, Sajur. By our Sutra now. Sasa. Sasajushoho. Ruhu. So Ruhu has happened. Now what will happen to this Repa? This Repa is Padanta. Padanta Repa and Avasana. There is nothing else. Repa. What, what will happen? It will take Visarga Adesha. And it will become, uh, actually, if, uh, what will happen, there is, uh, uh, there are a few more sutras here. Vro uh, Rupadhaya Dirgaha. So, um, see Sajush, let me just mention what is the Sajush. Uh, So Sajus is, um, there is a Sutra Vrur Upadhayaha. So there is an Upadhadhirgha here. It will become Sajur by Roho. Refa Vakara. Refa Vakara Vrur Upadhayaha. Roho Vrur Upadhayaha. Dhirgha. There is a Sutra. Which gives, makes the Upada Dhirgattu. Just for completion, I am mentioning it. We uh, will see the sutra when we hit there. But uh, what it says is that uh, there is an Upada Dhirga for a Refa ending or a Vakara ending Dhatu, which is at the end of a Pada. So, Padanta. So, what is happening here is uh, this Ukara, this Ukara is taking Dhirga. Then this Refa will become, it will become. Visarga. It will become Visarga the way we have seen Padan Sakara Sasoju Shoho Ruhu and uh, Khari Avasaneo. Here we have seen Khari example. Earlier we have seen Khari example now Avasana Khar Khari Avasana Khari Avasaneo Ravasaneo Visarjaniha. So thereby you get a Visarga Adesha and then this is a Padam, Suptingantam Padam. So that we remember, once in a while we will add this Sutra also, Suptingantam Padam. So this is a Padam, Sajuhu. So that's the example here. What are the other examples? Say Ramaha. So Rama plus Su, what will happen to Rama plus Su? Ramas. It will become Ramas. Then Ramar, then Ramaha. That's all. All for the, even Sasaju Sh Show itself we've seen. Sasaju Show is also similar. Padanta Sakara will become Refa uh, by Sasaju Show Ru, and then Refa will become Visarga by Kharavasani or Visarjaniya. Not Khari, Khariyosana. Kharavasani. Next sutra is Atoro Raplutha Raplute. Atoro Raplutha Raplute. So Ataha, 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 Roho, Roho, Aplutha Raplute. Aplutha Raplute. So what is Ataha? Ataha. Ataha is Panchami Ekvachana. Panche, roho, Roho is what? Shashti Ekvachana. Aplutat, Panchami Ekvachana again. Aplutat Ataha. And after an At, the Ro, Ro is what? 
raha, refa, refa, which is preceded by an at, which kind of an at, apluta at, apluta and at, basically at, at itself you don't need to, taparakarana is done, therefore at is, means only akara, but apluta is also mentioned, therefore uh, non pluta others will also be included there, but ikara, ukara, and then uh, ikara, ukara, ityadi, but at, at will restrict it to only uh, taparakarana of akara. What will happen? Roha aplute. What is the adesha do? Aplute. When an apluta follows, that to when Saptami question apluta follows, what is the adesha? So 61113. Go to 61113 in the Sutra Patha. So 61113. It's a huge Anga, anga chapter, Anga Sri uh, 61113. Here. What is the Adesha here? Ruta Ut from Ruta Ut. Ut, ut goes till 112. Uh, that's not right. This does not seem to be right. Just a second. Uh, if you if you have this marked as 112, please mark it as uh, further, it should go to 113 as well. So, 61113. Let me check in this my sutra part, a printed one. Please check your book. What, what do you have there? If you have uh, marked it as 112, then you need a correction there. So, it should go till 114. So it should go till 114. This is wrong. So it should go to 114. Okay. So 114. So we have Ator or Aplutad, Aplute, Ut. Ut is the Adesha. Ut is what? Taparakarana is done. Uh, Hraswa Ukara. Hraswa Ukara is the Adesha there. Therefore, what will happen is that the Adesha will be Ut. Ut is the Adesha Prathama Ekochana. What does Lagukara say? Lagukara say Aplutad Ataha Akara say meaning Aplutad Ataha ata, uh, Akarat means Akarat Parasya Roho Ru. Here also same Sandhi. Rori. Raha. Ro, it is not Raha. Deva say Roho Ru. So Rohoru, what does that say? Only a, a refa of a ru, not any refa. If you take this as raha, if you take this as raha, then it will mean any refa, but not any refa. Here roho refa se eva. So therefore this is roho, roho ru syad. Syad aplute ati. So when, when an apluta at, so ati is also there. In fact, another thing is ati here, ati. So this also should go to uh, 113, sorry. This also should go to 113. Uh, 114 I mean, sorry. Maybe 113, I don't know, let me check. So that may be 113, as long as it comes to our sutra, we are okay. Yeah, 113. Because Hashi is here, it should be only till 113. Even if it comes here, it's meaningless. So 113, Atur or Aplutad, Aplute, Uth ati, ati pare. So when aplute ati pare. So ati is also here. Ati is in samanadi karanam with what? With aplute. And ataha is in samanadi karanam with apluta. So apluta ataha, aplute ati pare, roho udadesha bhavati. That's what is the meaning. Example given is shivaha archeha. So shivaha archeha, vandyaha archeha. So, what will happen here? Shivaha Archeha. Now, Visarga is not born, mind you. This is Shiva plus Su. Shiva plus Su is was Shivas. It is Shivas. So, Shivas Archeha. What will happen to Sakara? Here, A is following. A is following. What, what should happen here? Shivas Archeha. Now, Shivaru. It will become Shivaru, Shivar, Archeha. No condition. 
for Shiva Sakara to become Prefa. What is the condition? Padanta. That's all. Padanta Sakara. Is it a Padanta Sakara? Yes. Then Sasajushoru will apply and you will get Refa here. This is a Roho Refa, not any other Refa. Shiva Archeha. Now what happens to Shiva Archeha? It will not even Shiva Archeha. Prakriya is not complete. Then he says Ato Roho. Ataha. So Shiva Archeha, what is the condition? Shiv. A is there which is At. Then Refa is there which is Roho Refa. Then you have Akara which is an Apluta. So this Akara is an Apluta. So Apluta Ataha. Aplute Atipare Refasya. Which kind of Refa? Roho Refasya. Roho Rusya. Uh, Roho. Uh, this is actually not Rusya. Syat. What is this? Who's Syat? Just a second. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, this is actually it is not Ruhu, it is Uhu. It is Uhu Syat. Sorry. So there is a typo there. Roho Uhu Syat. Uh, so it is actually written as Roru. Okay, sorry. It is mentioned as Roruhu. So Roruhu. Roruhu is what? So it is not Ru. ru roho Uhusyat. Roho Uhusyat. Because Uthi is the Adesha, not uh, Ru. Ru already Ru is there. Ru takes Uhu Adesha. That's what it means. So there is a uh, Ru uh, was separated as Ru. There actually uh, Refa is in the Sandhi. Roru is what? Roho Uhu. That's what it is. And by saying Roho, what does it mean? It is not uh, uh, Raha. That's what it means here. Here I'll put it in bracket. Ru. Ruhu. Ruhu Refasya, Ruhu Refasya, not any Refa, Ruhu Refa, Refa. That will take which Adesha? Uhu Adesha. Thereby what will happen? This Refa now in this Sandhi, I just separated these letters. This is the Sandhi now. In this Sandhi what will happen? Shiva, Shiv, A, U, A. A space here. A, U, A. Now what happens with this? This is the Adesha. Now what will happen here? Shiva, U and A. Between A and U, what is the Sandhi here now? Ad Gunaha. Therefore, Shiva, Shivo. Shivo will happen here. Shivo, Archeha. This is by what? Ad Gunaha. Ad Gunaha Bhoti. Guna between Akara and Ukara, what is the Guna letter? Okara. Therefore, you will get Shivo. Shivo Archeha. Then, so our sutra is Atoro Rapluta Apluta is here. Plute. So Shiva Archya, now what will happen? Eng of Padanta Dati, therefore Purva Rupa Sandhi will apply and then it will become Shiva Archya by Eng. You have an Eng letter here. Padanta the Eng. This O is an Eng letter and which is as Okara is Shiva. Shiva is a Pada. So Shivo Shivo uh, Padantasya Ukarasya Engaha Padantad Padantad uh, Enga Padantad Ati. This when Akara Akara follows Ati Pare Puro Rupa Vati. Puro Rupa is Okara. So uh, Puro Parayu Okarasya Ekarasya Chastane Okara Adesha Vati. Puro Rupa Sandhi. Therefore Enga Padantad Ati. What is the Adesha? 
पूर्व पूर्वरूप अलस्य पूर्वरूप एकादेश एक एकादेश हैपेंस एंड देन यू गेट शिवोर्च व्हिच इज द फॉर्म हियर शिवोर्च ओके लेट मी सी काशिका इफ इट गिव्स एनी अदर एग्जांपल्स ठीक काशिका से इज ओके अतः किम लेट्स लुक एट अतः किम वाय अत हेज बीन सेट अतः किम सो हिज एक्सापल इज अग्नि अग्नि अत्र सो वॉट विल हैपन विथ अग्नि अत्र या अग्नि अग्नि अत्र सो इफ अग्नि इज वॉट अग्निस अग्नि अत्र इज आल जस्ट पुट दिस इन ब्रैकेट बिकॉज दिस इज वॉट इज युअर थिंकिंग अग्नि अत्र बट अग्नि प्लस सू अत्र इज वॉट अग्निस अत्र देन अग्निर अत्र बाय ससो जुशो रू अग्निर अत्र दिस इज दिस इज क्लियर राइट उपदेश जन्मनासिक तस्य लोपा देर बाय अग्निस अत्र देन ससो जुशो रू यूल गेट अग्निर अत्र वॉट हैपन्स नाउ नाउ हियर अत्थ इज नॉट प्रिसेडिंग इकारा इज अप्लुता ऑल राइट सो अप्लुताद अप्लुते अकारा इज फॉलोइंग विच इज अप्लुते अति एंड अप्लुताद इज ऑल्सो कंडीशन इज मेट बट इट अत अतः इज नॉट मेट देर फोर अतः इति किम देर इज एन इथ हियर देर फोर वॉट विल हैपन इट विल रिमेन दिस वे नो आदेश अग्निरत्र अग्निरत्र देर इज नो अग्निरत्र इट सेल्फ दिस इज वॉट विल हैपन हियर अग्निरत्र अतः इति किम वॉट एल्स इज देर ओके ओके सम मोर कॉम्प्लिकेटेड एग्जाम्पल्स आर देर सो ही गिव्स अति 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 इत्यव मीन्स अति किम लेट्स जिस पुट अनदर क्वेश्चन हियर अति अति इति किम वाय अति हैज बीन सेड से लेट से अप्लुत नॉन अत्युटे मीन्स ई इकार इह लेट से इह एंड इह विथ दैट ही टेक्स एन एक्जापल वृक्ष इह वृक्ष इह अगेन इन ब्रैकेट्स बिकॉज इट इज नॉट डिराइव डेट इट विल बी वृक्ष वृक्ष वृक्षसु इह विच विल बी वृक्ष इह इह देन इट विल बिकम वृक्ष रू इह वृक्षर वृक्षर इह नाउ वॉट विल हैपन रेफ सो हियर ओके हैव टू लुक सो रे हियर ही सेज दिस सूत्रा विल नॉट अप्लाय सो वॉट विल हैपन नाउ दिस रेफ खरवसानोर विसर्जनीय इट शुड हैव बिकम विसर्जनीय खरवसा अवसानोर Uh, if you put a avasana there, khar is also not there. Avasana is not there. Now what will happen here? Rukshar iha. Uh, another uh, sutra will come into, and you will get. Uh, okay, what is the sutra there? Let me see other examples here. We uh, have to go back to more sandhis now. So the form is ruksha iha. Ruksha iha. Uh, Okay, let me see. Just listed some examples there. Apluta diti kim ashrita. Okay, vruksha ashrita. There are too many examples in uh, uh, Kashika given and uh, in uh, Laghu commentary. One commentator says there uh, there are too many examples, so these are skipped. 
he says that these are explained in detail in Siddhanta Kaumudi. So, Vruksha uh, Iha will become Vruksha Iha. I will not get into details right now because these are not the Sandhis here. Sandhis are much more, san other Sandhi rules will apply here. We will see uh, other Sutras. So, I will not look at uh, uh, many examples here. I mean, we will look at other examples as well. I will just list them. There is, see, Tasya Api uh, Taparatvad Na Bhavati. He says, uh, for what Patratra Ati Tiva Vruksha Iha Tasya Api Taparatvad Atra Na Bhavati. So, tap, other example here is Vruksha Ashritaha. What will happen with Vruksha Ashritaha? So, Vruksha, let's say, Vruksha Vrukshaha Ashritaha. Here also, Vruksha Ashritaha, what will happen? Here also, there will be, there will be Lopa here. See, here you will have to go through a lot of sutras of, uh, you know, uh, Yaka Radesha, Lopa Shakalya Sitya. So, I am just skipping those. Same thing here also. Here also, same thing, Ashrita. This Akara, Akara is also what? It is uh, not it is Vruksha, it is Apluta, uh, Apluta it is given, it is not Apluta, therefore it is an Apluta, then why here there is no Ukara Desha, uh, sorry, uh, this uh, Atorur Apluta Aplute, why is there no Uda Desha? So, he, example is what? A, A, A is Apluta, it, but it is not At. So, At has been added, so here there are two examples, Ati Kim, here, Atiti Kim, here he gives Ikara and also gives another example where Avarna is there but At is not there. Taparakarana is done, therefore this Dirgha is also, although it is Apluta, still it is not an Apluta At. That is mentioned there. Then Apluta, another example, Apluta also is taken. There are, uh, so Apluta example, Pluta example is given there. So Pluta uh, cases, there will be no Sandhi. Pluta is when you call out someone, that example he uses uh, or some uh, Vedic example may be there, where there are Plutas used. So next sutra is what? Hashicha. Hashicha is just the next sutra to uh, see 61114. So this, this 113 and 114, Atorur Apluta Aplute Ut and that Ut continues here to 114 as Adesha and you get Hashicha. Hashicha Kim Bhavati, Hashicha Api. Udadesha Hoti. So Hashicha. Hashi. Hashi Pare. So not only when At follows, but Hashicha Pare Udadesha Hoti. Kasya. He says Tatha. Similar. Just like earlier. Just like earlier, uh, he says there will be Udadesha. Shivaha Vandya. He takes the example Shiva Vandya. Shivas Vandya. What will happen to Shiva? Shivasu. Shivasu. Then Shivas Vandya. Shivaru. Shivar Vandya. Then this Vakara is what? Vakara is Hash. Vakara is Hash. Hash is what? Hayavarat. Starting from Hayavarat Sutra. Then Hayavarat. Um, till third of the class, fifth, fourth, third. So, Nyamagananam, Jhabai, Ghadadash. So, all those will come uh, till the third of the class. Now, Vakara is what? Hayavarat. In that sutra itself, Vakara is there. Therefore, Hashi Pare Udadesha Bhoti. Kasya Roho. So, all those are there. The entire uh, this uh, Atoro Rapluta Aplute, that Roho will take what is that? Roho. Roho Udadesha Bhoti. And what kind of, again, same thing, ataha, what does, uh, aplutad, aplutad ataha roho ut, so all that is, will continue there, aplutad ataha, so aplutad ataha continues, but athi is not there, so aplute is no longer valid, because hashi, hakara is, uh, hakara adi, so hashi, so all these are consonants, therefore only the preceding, continues as anuvritti, but what follows, there is no anuvritti because that is replaced by hash, hashi. 
Hashi Pare. So therefore, Shiva U, U is the Adesha here. U and then Vandyaha, Adgunaha will give you Shivo Vandyaha. Now this Hash, you can take many examples with Hash. So Ramo, uh, with Hakara you will get say, uh, Shivo Hasati or with Yakara, Ha, Ya, Varat, each of those Yati, Vandya. So here itself we can say, Shivo Vandya, Shivo Hasati, Shivo Yati, so Rauti, Likhati, Pashyati, uh, so, uh, so nyak, something with Nyakara, not Pashyati, Nya. So something uh, with Nya, you, we don't know words starting with Nya. So Nyakara itself, Nyakara, Ramaha, Nyakara, or Nyavaha, Nyakaram, Pashyati, Likhati. So Shivaha Nyakaram Likhati. So there are near, when Nya follows, then also you will have. So all those till the third of the class, starting from the fifth downwards. Hayavarat Sutra, Hayavarat Land, Nyamagananam, Jabai, Ghadadash, Jabagadadash. Till then, all these will cause Ukara Adesha when preceded by a At. And the same counter examples you can take. These counter examples, again, instead of Atra, you put the uh, Hash Pratyari. Shabdaha. So Shiva Vandyaha. Next sutra is which uh, we have seen during Lopa Shakalya we have seen. So Bho Bhagavago Apurvasya Yoshi. Bho Bhagavago Apurvasya Yoshi. This is a single word. Shashti Ekvachana. It's a Dvandva. Yaha. Yaha is the Adesha Yakaraha. Yakara Adesha Ashi Pare when Ash follows when Ash follows and what are these Bhoho Bhoho Bhagoho so Bho is Sambodhana when you say Bho Ramaha Bhago Ramaha and say Agho Manusha whatever so and Apurvasya Apurvasya is Apurvaha Yasmat. So, so what is that? that? That is, if you look at the Anurutti here, 8.3.17, you will see in 8.3.17. So 8.3.17 says what? Roho. So Roho comes here. Roho. Bho Bhago Ago Apurvasya Roho. So, Roho is in Samana Dekran with Bho Bhago Ago Apurvasya. But uh, Apurva Refa, which Refa? Ru, Ru Refa. Refa of Ru. That Refa which is preceded by A. A is what? A Varna. A will, it is not At. At Purva is not said. Akara Purva is not mentioned. So, A Purva means what? A Varna. Akara, Akara or Akara. When Ro, ru is preceded by a, a or a or by bho bhago ago then what will happen that refa will take yakara adesha when when followed by ash pratyara ash pratyara letter is what we have seen hash so it uh, hash and preceded by ach ach plus hash is ash so ashi pare is what achi hashi achi hashi is ashi so either you have a vowel or you have a vowel following or you have a hash pratyara letter following which we have seen earlier. So what will happen? Then example, uh, so okay, before the example, we just finish this, roho. Roho is shashti ekvachana. So of ru, ru is the stani, ru will take this adesha. What does lagukara say? Etat purvasi, etat purvasi is this pada et. Etat bho bhago ago is ago apurva is etat. And samasa apurva, I'll just mention apurva a a varna. A is equal to a varna a varna ha a varna ha purva ha yasmat. That which is preceded by that is what apurva ha tasya apurvasya. That is the samasa there, apurvasya, and then itare tara dvandva. Not itare tara, it would be, so it's in singular, 
therefore uh, so apurvam we have to take apurvam even if however you take it uh, it will be a singular finally it will become what it will become a tasya uh, apurva oh, actually uh, instead of making it this way all of this not apurvasya bho bhago so all that bho uh, bhago ago apurvasya you can make itaratara dvandva and all those are preceding so i'll say instead of that not a varnaha i'll say bhos because it's a bauri i can make a single vigra vakya bhos cha bhos is a pratiparika okay bhos bhagos pratiparika aghos i'm just for clarity i'm writing it this way aghos otherwise it will it has to be mentioned as I'll just mark it in quotation so that there is no confusion. A ghost, sir. Uh, Avarnascha. This is Zandva, and sir is Va here. You have to understand Va. Purva ha yasmat. So this sir is actually Va. Any of these. any of this bhos bhagos agos or avarnaha va purvah yasmat since we don't have va with va we can't make a dvandva but that chakara is varte there purvah yasmat because all will not be preceding one of them will be preceding so this is a dvandva this is a dvandva and that dvandva to bahuri is purvah yasmat yasmat that is what bho bhago all that till apurvah tasya apurvasya tasya The entire thing, tasya, bho, ityadi, apurvasya. So etat, that is etat. Etat purvasya, roho, yadesha ha, ashi. Yadesha is what? Yakara adesha. Yakara adesha ashi pare. So example is what he says, deva ih. Uh, he deals with the avarna earlier, and then he deals with bho bhagos agos iti santa nipata ha. We'll see this example, but we'll let's finish the vritti. भोस भगोस अघोस इति सांता निपाता सांता मीन्स वॉट सकारा अंता अंते ये शांते सांता दिस निपाता दे आर निपाता मीन्स दैट्स आउट द वर्ड फॉर्म इज भोस भगोस अघोस यू कैन डिराइव इट फ्रॉम अ धातु दैट्स आउट दे आर दे आर सकार अंत एंड निपाता मीन्स वॉट दे आर अव्यय दीज आर लिस्टेड इन सम चादी वर्ग सो चार ये असत्व देर बाय दे विल बिकम निपाता हा एंड निपाता विल बिकम अव्यय दे विल गेट एन अव्यय संज्ञा सो चार ये असत्व एंड देन स्वराधि निपातम अव्ययम सो स्वराधि निपातम अव्ययम देर बाय भोस अघोस एंड अघोस आर निपाता एंड देर अव्यय सो व्हाट ही इज टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस तेषाम रोर यत्वे कृते विल सी दैट लेटर आफ्टर यू फिनिश दिस एग्जांपल देवा देवा हा इह so he is taking this example devaha ih what is this devaha ih akaranta aka see pada is aka, akara akara and then uh, sakara is there this sakara is what sakara this is devaha devaha are what deva plus su au jas so it is a jas Just pratyara is there. What is the form? Devas. It will become devas now. The content of just is as. This is one uh, prathama bhuvachana. Devas ih. So it will become devas ih. This jakara is it by what? Does anyone know the sutra? Jakara is it by what in just? Suom just. Upadeshi janunasi ka it. हलंत्यम वॉट एल्स इज देर जकारा डज एन इवन नो सूत्र जकारा बिलोंग्स टू विच वर्ग चुटू सो बाय चुटू बाय चुटू chutu this and then 
chutu it and then tasya lopa deva thereby jakara goes and us is the content deva plus us will become what devas devas so you have devas here devas ih what happens to the last sakara saso yushoru it will become deva devar devar ih with devar ih by saso yushoru now this is a room saso yushoru sasa sasa jusho ruhu by this we have got refa adesha what happens to this refa now bho bhago ago apurvasya is this refa apurva it is apurva it's a r r is what a akara akara is what akara is a uh, is a avarna it is an avarna a includes its all its uh, other all the varieties all the all varieties are uh, anunasika ananunasika dirgha pluta all those are included here in a therefore a is part of a therefore this ru is what this ru is apurva ru it is an apurva ru this is an example for apurva apurva so apurva example devah so dev r and what is it followed by it is followed by ikara ikara is what ikara is is ash is part of ash therefore now this sutra is applicable and therefore ashi pare apurvasya roho yah adesh bhavati thereby you will get what you will get y here devai you will get devai ih so this is the form devai ih now optionally there can be a lopa by lopa shakalasya deva yakara lopa can happen and you can get a deva ih form by lopa shakalasya shakalasya acharyasya matena लोपशाकल्यस्य ऑप्शनल फॉर्म अदरवाइज बाय भो भगो अगो अपूर्वस्य योशी यू विल गेट देवाय इह सॉरी इंस्टेड ऑफ टाइपिंग आई एम जस्ट ट्राइंग टू कॉपी पेस्टेड सो हियर बाय भो भगो अगो अपूर्वस्य योशी देवाय इह आवर सूत्र इज अप्लाइड हियर optionally deva ih therefore he has given these two forms deva ih or deva ih deva ih just varna milna you do you will get deva ih yeah now what he says bhos agos agos what about those three iti santa nipata tesham roho yatve krute so tesham roho yatve krute means what bho bho ago whenever these are followed by ash ash pratyahara then see what are these examples bho devah bhago namaste ago yahi so we'll take these examples here tesham ro roho yatve krute what does that mean these three examples here with these three examples what will happen we are taking these as example so will so bhos devaha here only itself i'll type bhos devaha bhagos namaste and agos yahi see when do you use this bho is used for anyone bho ho so bho can be used as an address sambodhana for anyone they this is a sambodhana vyakti devaha plural he bhago ho bhago ho is used for bhagwan bhago bhago is used bho can also be used but bho devaha bhago shivaha it can be used agho is used for a papi generally for a papi or a uh, basically down it is a lowly usage you know it's a lowly usage so ago yahi means yahi is go away 
simply just go away. So you keep a person who is lowly or a uh, one who has done papa. Uh, Shastra says you keep distance. Therefore, he is asking go away. So there, agho is used to show that that person is lowly. By conduct, uh, the person is lowly. Otherwise, uh, for uh, divinity, use bhago, and bho is general can be used for anyone. So bhago you will see mostly in Puranas or in uh, in Vedic usage, etc. So what happens with these three? Now sakara will become room. So you will get bhor. So all these three will become. I'll just put it in a single line here. All these will become repa. So that's what he's saying. Roho, tesham roho. Now you have got roho, tesham roho, ru repa, repa yatve krute. When they become yat. Yakara, yakara by this sutra, bho bhago ago apurvasya yoshi. Therefore, it will become bhoy. So this will become bhoy devaha. All this, there is no uh, full stop here. Namaste, you can say, but there is no real full stop here. It's still in prakriya vasta. So bhagoi namaste and Aghoi Yahi. This is still being derived, so I'll say dot dot dot. Then Yatve Krute. So that's what the meaning is. Tesham Roho Yatve Krute. When the Ru has taken Yakara Adesha by Bho Bhago Agho Apurvasya Yoshi, then Hali Sarvesham. Earlier what? Earlier it was said. Earlier it was said that Lopa Shakalisya. Shakalasya Matena. See 8322. 8322 Sutra follows what this sutra. Lopa Shakalisya. So Shakalasya Matena Ashipare Lopa Bhavati. But Sarvesham Munina Matena Hali. So Sarvesha munina matena uh, hali, hali pare, when a consonant follows, then there is lopa of yakara. Therefore, here, hali sarvesham kasya lopa vati vyoho. Vyoho goes to 22. So, vakara yakara yoho. Vyoho, shakti divachana, vyoho hali sarvesham lopa. Lopa also comes down from lopa shakalisya. You see this. Uh, Lopa goes till 22. Therefore, Vyoho Vakara Yakara Yoho Lopa Bhavati Sarvesha Munina Matena. For everyone, everyone says that there should be Lopa Yoho Sarvesha Hali Hali Pare. When a consonant follows. I'll just finish this derivation. Just a couple of more minutes. What do they say? Bho Bhago Ago Apur Vasya. All that entire thing. See. This entire thing goes there to 22. Therefore, you have uh, bho bhago ago also. Bho bhago ago apurvasya vyoho vakara yakara yoho lopaha bhavati. So here he says bho bhago ago apurvasya yasya. Yasya is yakarasya, not yasya as in. Yat Pratipadika, Shashti question, it is not that, it is Yakarasya, Yasya Yakarasya. Yakarasya. See, although, although Vakara is also there, Vakara examples may not be there. So, therefore, why, why may not be there? Because see, Bhago, Ago, uh, Bho, Bhago, Ago, they take Yakara Adesha by the earlier Sutra. Vakara Adesha is not there, it is just continuing here from this sutra here, he your your uh, this this sutra, the view is continued. But Bakara has no use in this sutra here. In uh, Lopa Shakala, say it, it may have use, but Hali Sarvesham it does not have any use because Lopa Shakala uh, uh, ayava ayava sandhi by that Lopa Shakala has pravritti there also. Here in Hali Sarvesham, uh, there, there may not be pravritti there. Therefore, he says Yakarasya 
यस्य यकार से लोप स्याद हली परे स्याद स्याद धली स्याद धली स्याद हली संधि से and there by what will happen this bho bho deva yakar lopa therefore bho deva ha bhago namaste will become bhago namaste and agho yahi will become agho yahi so that is the sutra hali sarvesham we will see ro supi in the next part ha नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ 